back? I don't see her in her frame, but and then Marie or Bree Stevens is also on the call. I don't think we heard from her. Oh yeah, yeah yeah. Hi Bree. Hello all. Hi. Can everyone see me? How are y'all doing? Well, Hi. Now. I'm, oh my goodness. Well, I would like to introduce myself. I'm Bree. I snuck in here kind of late. I apologize. I'm still getting used to this whole different time zone thing when I'm traveling. So I'm trying to make make the best of it. Um, I am an activist and I'm a community organizer. I've just started on this journey. I'm 24 years old. I'm a graduate of Austin Peay State University. And while I was there in Clarksville, I was able to do a lot of activism work, a lot of um, around the spaces of brown folks, women, uh, LGBT plus community work when it comes to health, education, um, disparity, and um, economic opportunity. And I recently have moved to Chattanooga where I've started working in that space with entrepreneurs and equity um, and what that looks like in places and spaces around town, what that looks like for creatives and what that looks like for millennials who are trying to start their career. Um, and I worked with CoLab, which is a nonprofit based in Chattanooga, downtown Chattanooga. And from there, spun the relationship between um, all of this <laughs> placemaking is where I sat on the local host committee and I was able to um, implement things within the host committee that helped bring forth change for not only the placemaking conference, which is really fun, but also um, the work that comes after, which you all know is the most important. So what that looks like for us to continue this work on a more substantial basis and how can we make it more impactful? Thanks, Pri. And Monica and Jim, 